it's time to play with vacuums again. And remember, a vacuum is not what you clean your house with. It's when you take an object and you take all the air inside okay, and remove all the molecules. And if there's no molecules in that space, we call that a vacuum. All right, so I have two metal disks. And if I connect a special vacuum pump, in other words, it, it specializes in taking the air out of things, to these two metal disks, all right, I'll place them together. And then when I turn the pump on, it will suck all the air out from between the disks. Okay? And now the pump has removed all the air between the disks. I can turn this little valve here, all right, and now it's sealed shut. So this is sealed shut. I can take this off. And there is no way I can pull these two things apart. There's absolutely no way. I can hang from this. Uh, the, the great experiment they did back a couple centuries ago is they put a team of, uh, I think it was 16 horses, eight horses pulled on this side and eight horses pulled on this side, and they tried to pull apart uh, two hemispheres all right, that had, had the vacuum, uh, had all the air removed on it. And what it shows you, the reason that I can't pull it apart is because air pressure is pushing down on it. And so all I have to do is let the air back in, all right, that simple little thing, and they come right apart. So I've put some balloons in a, in a bell jar, okay, and so remember bell jars, right? We're going to poke the vacuum pump up to this jar, and so it'll take all the air out of the jar, and we'll just have the air in the balloons left because the air can't get out of the balloons. And what happens when we turn the vacuum on? Well, if you remember the air pressure talk we had, the air inside the balloons keep pushing out on the balloons, but there's nothing to push back when we get in the balloon. And I'll get a little bit away here. You can see the balloons get bigger and bigger as the pressure inside, outside the balloons drops. There we go. And our balloons popped. The end. Okay, so now we're going to take a vacuum and we're going to make it move water around for us. So we have some green colored water on the left. All right. And just above it in the container is a little pocket of air. And that's a sealed container. And so when we take the air out of the bell jar, right, there's no pressure anymore out there. The pressure of the air inside the, the green jar is going to push down on the water, force it up in the tube into the little uh, uh, glass on the right. So here we go. It pushes it down over into the other glass. and we got all the water moved across. And we can move it back simply by adding air back into the chamber, which will push back down on the right jar and put all the liquid back into the left again. Some television shows have their stunt doubles. We've got Johnny the Marshmallow Man. And he is going to try and survive in a vacuum. So we're going to put him in. Oh, no, don't put me in. Oh, it's all right. He's all right. He's been specially trained to go in there. And what do you think is going to happen when we turn on the vacuum? Well, there's air trapped in the marshmallows, okay? And there's not going to be any air pressure pushing back in, so what do you think is going to happen to the marshmallows? I think they're going to get bigger. Johnny is going to get very buff. Look at how buff Johnny gets. Oh, look, there he is, buff Johnny. And then you can, and then when you let the air out, oh, he went on just a diet or something. Poor Johnny. Well, that's all right. No harm done. I'm sure he tastes just as good as always. For grand finale, we are going to take shaving cream. Shaving cream. There's a lot of air in shaving cream. All right. And so if we fill this thing up with some shaving cream, all right, and put it in here, it should be pretty impressive. We're going to take the air out of the bell jar, but there'll still be air trapped in the shaving cream, and what's it going to do? It's going to escape, it's going to try and relieve its pressure, so here we go. The shaving cream finale with the valve closed. There it goes. Look at the shaving cream go. There it goes. The shaving cream snake. It just keeps growing. It's going to take over the United States. Oh, yeah. This is the kind of demo you can't get on normal podcasts. You can't even see me anymore. This is awesome. Yes, Sri Bob, I really hope I don't break anything with this. Oh, that was beautiful. That was beautiful. And for the real the final finale is we can put the air back in and get a real good mess. Oh yeah. All cleaned up. Alright, so. 
This is Dr. Carlson and Johnny Marshmallow saying thank you for watching.